Hi, I am Mike Hendrickson, physical education here at Fargo South High School. A little bit about me. I grew up in Williston, North Dakota. I played college basketball and graduated from Minot State University. I have taught and coached in Montana for three years, Sawyer, North Dakota for a year, and Valley City High for two years before coming to Fargo South. I am also the head boys basketball coach here at Fargo South, and um, I do have a wife named Kim, and we have three grown children. Classes that I teach this year and, and uh, what I since I've been here at Fargo South are Fitness for Life, which is a freshman PE class, uh, PE2, team sports, and racket sports, and advanced racket sports. During the semester, here's what I, my expectations and what uh, students will be getting out of these classes, and that's experience the benefit of physical activity, um, assess their own personal fitness levels, practice responsible personal and social behaviors, participate in a wide variety of activities, hopefully have some fun and develop an appreciation for being physically active and having a good lifestyle. Two general areas in my evaluation and grading, it comes from number one assessment. We don't do a lot of uh, written, but we will do quite a bit of skill testing um, in our various activities. But the main part about it is participation. 10 points daily for dress, being on time, being engaged, doing the right things, having a book, those type of things that go on. Grades can be found on Power School. Um, on a weekly basis. Student expectations, be respectful, display a positive attitude, be on time, actively participate, change into your proper uniform, study and review for tests, complete your makeups once you miss a day, get it made up, um, and no phones. Makeup policy, which I just discussed a little bit here. If you miss a class and want to earn back your lost points, you have these options. Number one, uh, participate in another PE class. Probably the easiest way during your off hour is show up and uh, just go to another class. Doesn't need to be the same class and uh, just go with that teacher and do a makeup there. Plus we have re PE resource. Basically our weight room, cardio room is open from 2.30 to 5 every single day. Uh, get about a 30, 30 to 40 minute uh, workout in. There are some activities outside the school, but it will only be accepted if I say so. So make sure there's an open line of communication there. And as it says on the bottom here, Communication with the instructor uh, is the key. And again, all this needs to be done within five days of the absence. Medical excuses. Anytime uh, the student, hopefully it doesn't happen, but anytime it is a student visits a doctor, it's their responsibility uh, to, <coughs> excuse me, is to, um, you know, get that to my attention as soon as possible. And a, a doctor's note is the only, um, way they will be getting out of an activity. We do not want to see a note from a mom or a dad or somebody else that says that they can't participate. Have them talk to me um, about that type of thing. And on the bottom there says a note that the doctor sends should be something stating what they can do, not what they cannot do. Final information is, you know, if you need to contact me, please use the staff directory icon at the top of this web page to send me an email. I will typically respond within 24 hours. Otherwise, my office phone number is 701-446-2043. I look forward to working with your son or daughter in class, and this should be a great school year.